So if you are having some problems with your computer and you can't use it and you want to rescue some data like me, just follow these steps. First you need a USB flash drive with your Windows installed on it and make it bootable. You can find easily on YouTube, it's very easy to do it. And then an external drive or a USB flash drive to back up your data. So just plug these two on your computer and turn on and press the F2 button and wait until the BIOS appears. So in the BIOS you need to go to the boot tab and change the order of the boot. Okay, go to the boot option, just press enter and here you probably have the Windows Boot Manager option selected, it's the main one, you need to change to your USB uh, flash drive, in my case it's Kingston Data Travel, just press enter, now you need to save it, go to the save and exit option, tab, sorry, and go to save changes, press enter and save it, now to exit just press escape, and go to yes now it will start to load up you we need to wait a couple of seconds so the objective here is uh, allow us to use the notepad uh, from the command prompt uh, in the notepad you can use the, the uh, windows explorer and uh, with that you can transfer your data from your computer to your external drive or USB drive, whatever you are using. It's very easy to do it. So, don't worry about the language, it's Portuguese, it's the same thing uh, in English, so we'll just press this button it will say next and here go to repair your computer okay now we you can go to this symbol where it said uh, say um, travel shoot and here you need to change uh, to choose the command prompt option and here in the command prompt you, we need to find the Windows folder okay so first we need to list all the drivers from the the, um, the computer so we need to use this command line to list all the drivers on your computer don't worry about the command line because I will put the command line on the description but you can see it very closely okay just press enter and in my case I have these drivers so I need to go driver by driver until I find the Windows folder okay so I will first go to the C so just press C and the two dots okay and press enter okay now I'm in on the C drive and press and enter dear to see all the directories on the C drive. Now, as you can see, I have the Windows folder on the C drive, so here we need to open the notepad here, but first we need to enter the, the Windows folder. Just uh, enter CD Windows to enter the Windows folder. Now we are on the Windows folder, and here you just type notepad.x to execute the notepad. Press enter. Now with the notepad open, you just need to go to file, okay, and go to open, and here you can um, uh, transfer your data. So go to your computer and here you have 
in my case Toshiba is my external drive uh, my where I want to back up my data and my C drive from the Windows so I go to the C drive go to users go to my user and now I can go to my desktop and for example I have this file on my desktop but I have more files so just change this option here to all the files list all the files and here for example I want to transfer my Avicii true stories um, to my uh, drive so just uh, do a control C or right click on it and copy and here you can go to your PC go to your external drive or USB drive and paste it just press Ctrl V and it's transferring you need to wait a little bit so it's transferring so it's done so just uh, refresh to see it so right click refresh and boom a VG true story here you just need to close after you back up all you want close everything and turn off your computer and now to see if this have really transferring I'm going to open my external drive on another computer and show you that I have the Avicii True Stories on my Toshiba um, external drive. So thank you for watching, I hope this helps you.